good morning it is very early on a saturday the sun is not even up yet like it's just coming above the houses in all honesty we could probably do with a light going on here because i actually don't know if this daylight is enough i'm also so tired the coffee is so needed oh, oh my god also it's the first morning that i've woken up and there's been like um you know when you get all the like dew on the windows is that what you call it like the windows are looking frosty and the reason that i am up so early is because today for the first time literally ever i am I, I say that some people in this industry get to try on wedding dresses early but i'm going to try on wedding dresses i've never ever done that before never for a shoot or anything so i I'm so excited. This is like one of those moments that I've always dreamed of. I love fashion. I love playing dress up. I love a party. Weddings are just my favourite, favourite thing. These early stages of like planning my own have just been literally so fun. Well, apart from that moment when I was told I had a week to find a venue. That wasn't, that wasn't so fun. But we got through. Literally everyone I know said if anyone can do it, you can. And I was like, yep. Yeah. Just breathe and now we are at the fun bit i mean there's been lots of fun bits asking my bridesmaids as well very fun so today we are trying on wedding dresses i am taking my mum and then i'm also taking one of my bridesmaids as well it is a local appointment so it's perfect for my mum and my two bridesmaids that are more local to me so lucy is coming with me today and i cannot wait this is probably one of the few days in my life where i'm like rushing to get ready not because i don't want someone to judge me for being late it's i genuinely <laughs> i'm like i want to maximize the amount of time i have in this appointment i don't want to waste a single minute like normally i'm quite relaxed about like if i have paid for an appointment and i'm like oh i just have less time it's fine no today today i want to squeeze out every second from this appointment so we can't be late i'm also picking everyone up because i live the furthest from the show what do you call it showroom store store <laughs> it's early bear with me so i also have the stress of my mum will know if i am not running on time it's just so embarrassing as a child of the most organized woman in the world when you're not <laughs> organized at all no matter how hard i try i will never meet her level of organization like yesterday I literally hadn't even finished work and she texted me asking me what I was wearing today. I was like, hopefully a wedding dress? Other than that, no idea. For anyone that's horrified that my mother gets that level of sarcasm in response to a question, just know that I learned from the best. The best being her. So makeup wise today, we're going for something quick and nice and like dewy, a perfect kind of like quick, easy bridal look, I think. I'm going to use my charlotte tilbury look in a palette i don't know if they still do these if they don't they need to bring them back because these are so great just gone in with a bit of corrector to make me look a little bit more well rested because this morning the alarm went off before it was even daylight mega quick on the eyes let's go i'm starting with this really light shade and just patting that all over the eyelid normally i would try and make my hand movements look really relaxing and zen but this morning I'm just going to be stabbing my eye. Okay, then we're going to take a little bit of this shimmery shade and tap that in to the outer corner. Run it kind of along my lash line a bit under my eye. I've done it in a really messy way, so now we're going to just take a giant blending br brush and blend it all together. You do not have to be good at makeup to get a soft blended little bridal look. And then we're going to take this shade here on like a flat brush and we're going to stamp it into my lash line and then we're going to blend it out after as well I'm actually just creating like a wing this feels slightly wild for this time of the morning but we're just gonna roll with it i know when i've got dresses on i won't regret doing this we have 15 minutes to wrap this do hair get dressed also very excited because this morning is my first morning wearing my bride robe a little bit of the nars afterglow blush okay so what this has taught me so far is that i need to practice my bridal makeup let me know if that is something you would like to see my lips are a completely different shape first thing in the morning why can't they be like this all the time so i initially thought that i would do my own wedding makeup but this 
is kind of stressing me out and it's making me wonder if I shouldn't. What do you guys think? Like if my mascara or my eyelid situation happens when I've just spent a good 30 minutes on a on an eyeshadow look, I might cry. Isn't mascara just magical though? I use the bronzer from this palette as well. Okay, we are fast running out of that 15 minutes that I have to do my hair. So I need to move very quickly. This is a good bridal blush shade. Valentino Eyes Cheek shade four. So pretty, so natural. Love it. Love. For highlighter, I'm gonna use this one from the palette. I love the VB one, but it's very dewy and I just want the makeup to stay this morning. I feel like this highlighter might be a little bit dark for me. It's a better eyeshadow color, I think. And then we're just gonna set under my eyes and around my nose. And we're done. I always forget to take these out at the moment. My hair keeps going like really flicky and like sticking up at the top so I have to use these to flatten them. I'm going to leave my hair down but I'm gonna take, see what I mean? Like what is? <laughs> but I am going to take a scrunchie so that I can put my hair up depending on different dresses. Right, let's go. This is my outfit of the day. Victoria, I'm so sorry. I think I've accidentally stolen one of your looks. I did not mean to do this but it was a great outfit, so I'm not mad about it. Pop a picture here if you don't know what I'm talking about. I'm wearing a Skims vest top, my black trousers, Celine belt, which needs to, I need to get a new pair of black trousers. I literally say this every day. I actually don't like these that much, and the Celine belt is all that's holding them together right now because they're way too big. And then my Veja trainers, and then I'm wearing the new Jane and Tash jacket from the last vlog. I think you will have seen this in that it is so stunning i love it so yeah this is gonna be my first time wearing it that is the outfit i also just curled my hair and now i really regret it because the curls at the front have gone too poofy <laughs> so i'm hoping they'll drop i might like tie it up to like get them to go away regret this side like completely fell out so then i had to redo it but then it didn't match the other side and so yeah disaster but it's fine because it'll probably go up in like 20 minutes anyway yeah that is my outfit of the day i'm gonna go cut the tags out of this now you look stressed already. No, it's fine. It's just this row. I said to Dad, I need to be ready because she can't come in. Because we're going to have to park out there. And Good morning. There's nowhere to park out here. There's plenty I mean, of parking. Wait, it's Breathe. Parking. Hello. You look lovely. Thank you. Thank Are you me. excited? Yes, I am. Yeah. Are you proud that I was here at 9.59? I am very 59? impressed. <laughs> Morning. 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 <laughs> we're here. Oh my God. This is so exciting. Hello? Hi! There's so many. Actually, I want to start this side. I always say that I'm not like into the embellishments, but wow. when you see these in real life, they are so stunning. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> Did I put this one on my list? You haven't, no? But I wouldn't put it for you. love to try that one. It's my favourite dress in the shop, that Is one. It? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> For a Sarah Jessica Parker esque. Yeah. <laughs> when I was a teenager, that would be. Yeah. <laughs> so I've already sent through a load of styles that I really, really want to try on. So I'm just going through and making sure that there's nothing else that I've missed. Oh, that's cool. Wow. Oh, that's cool. Mm. No, I think I'm good. Yeah. I'm good. Yes, Ready we're being efficient. <laughs> ah! Oh my God, yeah. sis. Oh wow. And this is a classic fit and flare, so fit it to the knee and then throw it to the fit. I love this. That is stunning. It's wow. So nice. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's so wow. Really fun. Wow. I really like this one. That is stunning. Is this more fitted or is this one the fitted? Okay. Yeah. And once it's in the right size and it's all been taken in, it'll be tapered really nicely okay. underneath your bum, okay. which makes a big difference to mm -hmm. the fit as well. And it can come in slightly more here as well. I actually quite like it without it yeah. being weirdly. It's so exactly. pretty. Much more movement. Yeah. Especially yeah. in the heat as well. Yeah. 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 Okay. I don't think I'll be sweating. Very nice. Yeah. yeah. No, it's not. No. Oh my god, Princess Dice! <gasps> Sis! 
glasses. Oh wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. <gasps> oh my gosh. I love it. Stunning. That looks so lovely. Oh my god, there's so many layers. So this does have pull on puff sleeves. Wow. I wonder what they were up there. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Mum hasn't tried on wedding dresses in a very long time. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it actually looks in one. That is so stunning. Yes. Yeah, I love that bit, Suze. That's so lovely. I love the back of it as well. Yeah. If you have any Yeah, let's do one. Oh my god. I love that. So I would pair this with completely plain to complement the drafts. You look so, so tiny. So it meets the edge of your trend. Wow. You can see all the beautiful detail and all the buttons. Oh my god. Oh, I do you feel quite emotional. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, Lucy's crying. Oh. <laughs> That's really got me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh wow, it's so stunning, Sears. <gasps> oh my gosh. Wow. Yeah. Oh yeah. The shape of the skirt that's yeah. so nice. Yeah. It is a puddle. It is a puddle. <laughs> it definitely needed a veil. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Uh, oh there it is. Oh, yeah. Actually, I always thought that I would have a dress with this. Yeah. But I now put it on actually. I'm not sure. What's nice about this? Of the slit is when you when you stand, your legs not visible. Yeah. And then when you get those nice counted shots, you have a yeah. leg, which yeah. is really nice. You're exposed the whole time. Lots of brides getting married at my venue actually have dresses like this, yeah. and they have loads of photos up against the rocks that are like. Yeah. yeah <laughs> it's really popular. Yeah. Them. Oh. <gasps> wow. This is so fun. Nice. 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 Wow. Wow. I actually like this a lot more than I thought. It is. That is stunning. So classic. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I feel like it's very similar to two, but just the neckline's slightly yeah, different, isn't it? Yeah. And I think it's not as, um, it's more of a swisher. Yeah. 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 Even though this yeah. is classed as a foreground because of the amount of fabric that you've got underneath, mm -hmm. I would say to me this is more A-line. A-line. Yeah, because of the way it falls, but that just comes down to the, the thinness of the this fabric. This is the kind of A-line I like, though. Like yeah. The stress was really strong. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
it's such a light fabric, the trend doesn't hold its shape. Yeah. That would be the only thing, it doesn't have mm -hmm. the drama that you're after. Yeah. I do like a dramatic yeah. train. We said we were like, I can't believe how quick you get in and out yeah. of them. Oh yeah, no knocking about. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think oh, sure. before we'll get it done before we go so that we're like, oh, we are actually married yeah. and then we don't have the fat when we get back. Yeah, yeah. Especially because we've got another wedding literally the week we get back. So oh. we'd actually be rocking up to this wedding like, we just got married. No, we didn't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, sort of, but not really. So that's yeah. what I'm thinking. And you have two. Mm. Unless you want to use the same dress. <laughs> but I did, I did originally just think I'd wear like a small dress, like a little mini dress, but no, I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, you've been a princess yeah. for a morning. Do you think? Yeah. Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's very similar. Isn't it? So much more intricate though, this one. Yeah. 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 My food. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's fabulous. It's gorgeous. I love the way it kind of, it's almost like water. Yeah. Yeah. That is insane. This neckline really suits you. Yeah. It's really beautiful. Yeah. yeah. I do, I do like yeah. the other, the bigger dress had that as well, yes. didn't it? Yeah. Gorgeous. Yeah, it is really pretty. I feel like this would be more of a, if I had an evening mm. dress, it would be my choice. Yeah. yeah. I love it. <gasps> wow. Wow. <laughs> this would drive my man. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> I feel like it's kind of a hybrid of two and three, maybe. Like yeah. it does both. I love that. Wow. Just stunning. Really simple as well. Mm. Really good. Yeah. yeah. Did you ask about removing the bow? Yeah. yeah just. Yeah. yeah. So I noticed there's lots of um, bits over there that are really yeah, good to do. Yeah. If you wanted to glitter it up a bit, you would want to. I would. It up <laughs> a bit, yeah. So I think that might have been the most fun that I have ever had in my entire life <laughs> ryan just came home from london and he was like how was it and i was like literally the best morning of my life it was so so much fun i've just realized i've got a hairband on my wrist it's gonna annoy me i actually feel slightly exhausted just from having too much fun we went for a very long like coffee debrief after which was super nice my mum and my sister-in-law to be lucy they are I swear they're the same person. Like when I met Lucy, I was like, you are a mini version of my mom. You are adorable. I love you. And yeah, I just love them both so much and they make a great combo together. So yeah, it was just really, it was just the best morning. It's so lovely. I actually feel sad that I can't show you a couple of the dresses because they, they are contenders. I have so many more try-ons booked but two of them are contenders for like the dress. So I actually can't show you. If I find the dress, I think I'll like flashback to those ones and show you. So you will see them at some point if I don't go with them because I just think they're so beautiful and it would be a shame not to show you the ones that like don't make the cut. So hopefully I'll, I will get to show you at some point over the next like month or so. I think I have until December and then I need to choose. So I have quite a lot of appointments coming up in November in London and I think the rest of this month I'm going to book in a few more local appointments because my mum was like, can we do more? I was like, yes 
Yes, we can. It was just so much fun. We had the best time. I took some shoes with me this morning. I actually didn't end up putting them on, but there was one dress which I wish I had put them on for because you could see my feet. You'll have seen in the try-ons. I really hate that you can see my feet not in shoes in, the, in that try-on, but for the rest of them, I actually didn't need it. And it was quite comfortable to just be able to like step up onto the step, especially with so much extra material because obviously I'm so small. One of them was really like looked really crap because I didn't have any shoes on. A beautiful dress just it's definitely not going to be the one that I'll go with but it may, it looked extra bad because I wasn't wearing shoes so sorry about that one thing that everyone has always said to me is that what you think you're going to want going in is not what you end up coming out with and I actually asked my sister-in-law to be Lucy you've seen her I'm just going to call her Lucy from now on I asked Lucy this on the way in and she said that she knew what she wanted going in and she came out with exactly that she also did only go to one <laughs> wedding dress shop. So it will definitely be a different situation for me slightly because I'm gonna try on a lot of diff different dresses. I need to know, I just need to know. I need to know what's out there. I need to try everything on. But the one thing I will say is what I thought I would like, I do like. And I think that's partly because I've tried on so many dresses in my time. So I kind of know what suits me. But there were definitely some things that I thought would suit me more that I just actually didn't love trying them on i was definitely surprised in some ways but i can confirm that like a wrap styling anything with too much going on here isn't my favorite i'm actually really excited to try on some different designs though i think i just you probably will have seen i tried on a lot of like strapless designs i'm really intrigued to try something that's got a more interesting neckline i mean i i really like this area of my body i'm quite happy to have strapless but i do definitely want to explore different necklines with different designers and stuff like that and just get a grip for what i like so most of the dresses i tried on were from a brand called i think it was Mora Lee. i think i think that's how you say it i'll put it on screen just in case you are not local but you want to try and find any of the wedding dresses that i tried on and then there were a couple of others i think as well but you should be able to find them all on the website so i'll link the place where I went and the website and everything in the info box but yeah one of the others was a Rebecca Ingram dress which is the one that my mum loved it was like bardo off shoulder and my mum actually like fully <laughs> cried at that one there was another one that was a cry one but I actually can't show you that one but I feel like that's a sign ish actually I don't know because I didn't love the same one that my mum loved my mum has very different wedding dress taste to me but like still like lovely like all of them were so nice but i think when lucy like cried it was the one that i also like really really loved and i was like yes this is a sign so yeah so i'll link that if any of you want to check any of them out you're in different countries brian's just lying on the floor with the dog so i'm trying very hard to not really give too much away <laughs> We've just been discussing whether he's going to have to block me on TikTok for the next year. Not sure that's going to do me and my algorithm any favours. But I'm thinking maybe it could be good if you like see me in a couple of wedding dresses that aren't the one, then hopefully no one's going to cry and then I won't cry because if other people cry, I will cry. And I really don't want to be crying walking down the aisle, so... I'll cry. Do you think you'll cry? 100%. Do you think? Yeah. You were quite emotional at your brother's wedding, weren't you? I think I'll cry, but mostly because Shrimpy's not going to be there. <laughs> <laughs> be no, crying because he I'll misses cry. the dog. <laughs> this is the behind the scenes of my life that I don't normally show you guys. It's just these two, and then there's me. I am the third wheel. <laughs> also, I am really happy with my makeup today. It probably looks a little bit ropey by now, but I think I'm going to start doing like a bridal makeup look or a casual bridal makeup look more regularly because i feel like the makeup is slaying today i'm very happy with it this blush is well and truly blushing would highly recommend if you are looking for a nice blush i have just actually looked in a mirror and my nose makeup is terrible because i wore my sunnies to fix that before this evening's shenanigans the makeup is worn but i still think it's pretty I really like the eyes. I'm going to start making more effort on my eye makeup. I've just realised I have sleep in my eyes as well. Well, I must have looked so dishevelled for like the past 10 minutes. I'm actually giving myself the ick. Why am I so dishevelled? Not me thinking I look cute and then not actually looking cute at all. Anyway. Hello, my shrimp. We need to get you a bow, don't we? For our UK wedding. Yeah? You're so cute. Yes, you are. On that note, 
if anyone knows of like a UK town hall that is local to me if, so if you know if you're in the area you'll know that is local ish to me will travel happy to travel but if anyone knows of a town hall that actually lets dogs in please please let me know because because I, because I want my ceremony disrupted apparently but yeah if anyone knows of a way in which I can get my dog into a little town hall ceremony please let me know is it an ask for forgiveness don't ask for permission situation i would love to have her there or otherwise someone's gonna have to wait outside with you aren't they but you have to be there you're just the cutest oh, look at her <laughs>